John chapter 7 After these things, Jesus walked in Galilee, for he would not walk in Jewry, because the Jews sought to kill him. Now the Jews' feast of tabernacles was at hand. His brothers therefore said to him, Depart from here, and go into Judea, that your disciples also may see the works that you do. For there is no man that does anything in secret, and he seeks to be known openly. If you do these things, show yourself to the world, for neither did his brothers believe in him. Then Jesus said to them, My time is not yet come, but your time is always ready. The world cannot hate you, but it hates me, because I testify that the works in it are evil. You go up to this feast. I won't go yet, for my time has not yet fully come. When he had said these words to them, he stayed in Galilee. But when his brothers went up, then he went up to the feast also, not openly, but as it were in secret. Then the Jews sought him at the feast and said, Where is he? And there was much murmuring among the people concerning him, for some said, He is a good man. Others said, No, but he deceives the people. However, no man spoke openly of him for fear of the Jews. Now about the midst of the feast, Jesus went up into the temple and taught. And the Jews marveled, saying, How do you know this man's letters, having never learned? Jesus answered them and said, My doctrine is not mine, but his that sent me. If any man will do his will, he will know of the doctrine, whether it is of God or whether I speak of myself. He that speaks of himself seeks his own glory, but he that seeks his glory that sent him, the same is true, and no unrighteousness is in him. Did not Moses give you the law, and yet none of you keeps the law? Why do you go about trying to kill me? The people answered and said, You have a devil. Who goes about to kill you? Jesus answered and said to them, I have done one work, and you all marvel. Moses therefore gave to you circumcision, not because it is of Moses, but of the fathers. And you on the Sabbath day circumcise a man. If a man on the Sabbath day can receive circumcision so that the law of Moses should not be broken, why are you angry at me? because I have made a man every bit whole on the Sabbath day. Judge not according to the appearance, but judge righteous judgment. Then some of them from Jerusalem said, Isn't he of whom they seek to kill? But here he speaks boldly, and they say nothing to him. Do the rulers know indeed that this is the very Christ? How is it that we know this man is from here? But when Christ comes, no man will know where he comes from. Then cried Jesus in the temple as he taught, saying, You both know me, and you know that I come from here, and I have not come of myself. But he that sent me is true, whom you do not know. But I know him, for I am from him, and he has sent me. Then they sought to take him, but no man laid hands on him, because his hour had not yet come. And many of the people believed on him and said, When Christ comes, will he do more miracles than this man has done? The Pharisees heard that the people murmured such things concerning him, and the Pharisees and the chief priests sent officers to take him. Then Jesus said to them, Yet I am with you a little while, and then I go to him that sent me. You shall seek me, and shall not find me, and where I am going you cannot come. Then the Jews said among themselves, Where will he go, that we shall not find him? Will he go to the dispersed, among the Gentiles, and teach the Gentiles? What manner of saying is this, that he said, You shall seek me, and you shall not find me, and where I am going you cannot come? During the last day, that great day of the feast, Jesus stood and cried, saying, If any man is thirsty, let him come to me and drink. 
He that believes on me, as the scripture has said, out of his belly shall flow rivers of living water. But this he spoke of the Spirit, which they that believe on him should receive, for the Holy Ghost had not yet been given, because Jesus was not yet glorified. Many of the people, therefore, when they heard this saying, said, It is true, this is the prophet. Others said, This is the Christ. But some said, Shall Christ come out of Galilee? Hasn't the scripture said that Christ comes out of the seat of David and out of the town of Bethlehem, where David was? So there was a division among the people because of him, and some of them would have taken him, but no man laid hands on him. Then the officers came to the chief priests and Pharisees, and they said to them, Why haven't you brought him? The officers answered, Never has man spoken like this. Then the Pharisees answered them, Are you deceived also? Have any of the rulers or the Pharisees believed in him? But this people who doesn't know the law are cursed. Nicodemus said to them, he had come to Jesus by night, being one of them, Does our law judge any man before it hears him and knows what he does? They answered and said to him, Are you also of Galilee? Search and look, for no prophet is raised out of Galilee. And every man went to his own house.